Hello friends. Welcome to my channel My Inspiring Thoughts by Upatriti. The essence of my channel is to give you glimpses of the vast landscape of Indian culture and the richness of its heritage and traditions. I am equally eager to ignite curiosity about Indian culture in young minds and people from all over the world. After taking you through Natya Yatra my journey of the traditional dance forms of India let me give you an overview of the folk dances of India walk along my cultural journey to the world of Indian folk dance forms Lok Natya Yatra there are more than 100 folk and tribal dances in India I will touch upon the important ones and give you an insight to these dance forms through my eyes. Folk dances depict the culture, festive occasions, celebrations and finer aspects of the particular region. Indian folk dances are full of life and characterized by simple steps and basic movements. Generally, the dancers themselves sing with the accompaniment of the musical instruments of their tradition. All the artists are colorfully dressed with their unique costumes, extensive jewelry and props. Today, let me take you through an exploration of the folk dances of Arunachal Pradesh. Bhuya is a folk dance of the Degaru Mismi tribe. This dance is performed during festivals and joyous occasions which binds the people together. The movements of Bhuya are effortless as the dancers take one step at a time. The women make small graceful jumps to move forward while the men take higher jumps at a faster pace. Bhuya dance is usually performed to the beats of the drum gong and cymbal sometimes they even sing along the dancers are seen performing in traditional tribal wear chalo dance gets its name from the chalo loko festival of the nokte tribe of arunachal pradesh it signifies the paddy cultivation season which takes place during the months of october and november This dance is usually performed in the village chief's courtyard by all age groups. The performers wear unique tribal costumes and dance very gracefully to the beats of the drum, accompanied by live singing. Vancho dance is yet another brilliant folk dance of this state. It is performed by the Vancho tribe for the Uriya festival of arunachal pradesh it is a recreational dance which brings a feeling of solidarity among the members of the tribe it is very lively dance which is performed in groups and the steps are synced to the sound of the bells the colorful traditional attire enhances the festive mood Pasi Konki is a popular folk dance that depicts the rich culture of the Adi tribe. The dancers, both men and women, form a straight line and dance as if they are marching to the rhythm of a drum. The theme of the accompanying songs known as Abhang is the social work done by this tribe. The traditional costumes worn by these dancers enhances the performance and makes it more picturesque. Ponung dance also be- belongs to the Adi tribe and is usually performed as a prayer to the gods before the harvest season. This dance is performed by women who either dance in a straight line or in circles with simple easy steps. Usually a male performer known as the miri sings folk songs to provide the musical accompaniment for the dance. The dancers wear very simple yet elegant attire which consists of a black shirt or blouse and a colorful skirt wrapped around the waist. 
to complete the look, the women adorn themselves with traditional jewelry. Pophit dance is performed by the women of the Kalu tribe as a tribute to goddess Mopin Ape, who is the deity of prosperity and fertility. Pophit dance comprises of simple and elegant moves. This dance is very simple and graceful with basic steps and swinging feet in unison. A signature step involves holding a piece of equipment in the right hand and dancing with the body slightly bent forward. The dancers generally wear white colored traditional attire which creates an atmosphere of serenity. Now that you have been a great audience to this overview of some of the finer aspects of the folk dances of Arunachal Pradesh, I am sure the next time you witness any of the above dance performances, you will really appreciate the nuances. Namaskar till we meet again in the next episode of Lok Nati Yatra, My Cultural Journey of Indian Folk Dance Forms. If you haven't clicked the subscribe button, just do that and hit the bell icon so that you can get to be part of this traditional Lok Natya Yatra.